Like, comment, and subscribe for more on the latest tech, home, fitness, and lifestyle products with real life applications. All right guys, let's go ahead and get into today's video. Hello everyone, in today's video we're going over an amazing looking camera here. This is the 4 megapixel Wi-Fi PTZ indoor IP security camera from Amcrest, which allows you to live stream in 4 megapixel superior HD resolution, connects to Wi-Fi 2.4 or 5 gigahertz networks, remote pan, tilt, up to 16 times digital zoom, and is a fantastic looking product. It actually looks very modern as well like the overall design and everything never miss another moment connect to the people and places you care about power up your camera and start monitoring in a few simple steps illuminate the darkness with long range night vision up to 32 feet away store videos on a micro sd local pc nvr nas or amcrest cloud which is optional listen and talk through the camera's built-in speaker and microphone Cover more ground with a 120 degree super wide viewing angle and also get an instant notification when your camera senses movement, which is by far the most important out of all those in my opinion. Technical specifications, we have HD resolution up to four megapixels at 24 frames per second. Field of view is like I said before, two way audio as well. Pretty much went over everything on this side. What's included is the indoor camera, the plastic wall mount, the DC 5 volt power adapter, ethernet cable, and the quick start guide with a one year limited warranty as well. I do wanna give a big shout out to Amcrest for sending me this product. They actually sent me an email and asked me if I wanted to test this product and possibly do an unboxing for this channel. And I said, sure, I would definitely love to check it out. I've also done a review on the 1080p webcam from Amcrest and was definitely surprised with the overall specifications and quality of that product as well. If you guys can't tell, my son is going through a lot today. He is teething in the background. You guys may be able to hear him. Uh, I hope it's not too much of a hassle for you all. And I wanna thank you all for your patience as well. So let's go ahead and open up this box and see exactly what we've got today. I am very excited. I need to go ahead and grab my knife over here, which is a Kershaw blade. I can't remember the name of it, but it is very sleek and I'm very excited to have this as an addition to the channel. Just open up the box right from the side there and as soon as we open up the box we see the Amcrest quick start guide the Wi-Fi camera initial setup uh, the card for the warranty to join the community at amcrest.com forward slash community and enter your email address to sign up and you can enter that community for a chance to receive free newly released products for testing evaluation and product improvement purposes as well as exclusive offers on new product releases. So fantastic as well. Get one month free of your Amcrest cloud subscription and uh, just to use that code as well that you've seen right there. Important security notice, don't need to go over that really unless you feel as if you need to, but I'm not going to in today's video. Let's go ahead and take everything out and lay it to the side and get rid of this big bulky box. Now since we got everything out of the packaging, let's go ahead and get a little bit more in depth of a look. Overall, the actual camera looks amazing. Uh, the design is overall fantastic. Here is the place for your ethernet cable, your SD card, micro SD rather, your DC 5 volt. Uh, plug in for your power source and then your audio out and audio in and there is the microphone right there as well that picks up your audio and also transmits your audio uh, through two-way so let's go ahead and check that out with the wall mount you can actually screw it onto the base right here like so if I have it lined up correctly let me go ahead and make sure and once you have it screwed onto the bottom, you can actually place that onto the wall. Then you can control that, and then you can also pan, tilt, and zoom with the camera itself as well. Let's go ahead and take that off just so I can use it. Now since we got a chance to look at all the design features, let's go ahead and plug in the IP security camera and see exactly what the camera quality looks like because overall, that's what we're here for and that's what we wanna make sure is working properly. 
It's the overall camera. So let's plug it in and take a look at it for us, guys. I'm gonna go ahead and start by plugging in the actual power source. As soon as I plugged it in, did a little spin motion, and I'm not even sure what it's doing now. Now since I have the power source plugged in, let's go ahead and download the Amcrest Cloud app or the Amcrest View Pro app, depending on which way you are going to use the video storage, whether you're gonna use it through secure offsite cloud storage or micro SD card for most models. Let's go ahead and check it out. Once you open up the app, you'll be directed to a screen that looks like this. Press the plus button, add a device, Wi-Fi camera, and ethernet wi-fi setup which is what i'm doing currently it is connected to the ethernet cable to my router and camera wait until the camera leds turn green then tap next so your smartphone is connected to the router which it is and then allow while using the app now once we do that we have to scan the qr code on the back of the camera which i'm going to go ahead and do so now after you scan your QR code, just give your camera a name, set your username and your password, and then click next. Now, since the camera is successfully connected, we can remove the ethernet cable and wait 30 seconds, then tap to start live view. So I'm gonna go ahead and remove the ethernet cable. There is also a walkthrough to learn how to use the major functions of the app. So I'm gonna go ahead and walk you guys through that as well by pressing yes. There's quick stop and start, tap the stop start icon to close all the current live camera feeds or quick open the last cameras. And that one is right down there where the arrow is pointing. Enable talk, tap the microphone icon to enable talk. Enable listen, tap the speaker icon to enable listen. Two way audio, now you can talk and listen at the same time. Tap either or both of these icons to disable. To pan and tilt, swipe up down left and right to zoom in bring two fingers together on the screen to zoom out move two fingers apart on the screen resolution tap that hd icon to adjust your resolution change video quality switching to hd may slow down your video feed by default sd is enabled tap the pencil to see advanced settings take a snapshot tap the camera icon to take a snapshot of the current live feed Function slider, swipe left or right along the bottom bar to reveal more functions. Manual recording, tap the camcorder icon to start and stop a live manual recording of the current live feed. Mirror and flip, tap the mirror slash flip icon to expand the mirror and flip sub menu. Mirror and flip once again, tap the vertical icon to flip the image vertically or tap the horizontal icon to flip the image horizontally. Toggle night vision, tap the moon icon to toggle night vision on and off. Image adjustment, tap the paintbrush icon to expand the image settings submenu. Change image settings, modify the brightness, contrast, hue, and saturation of your live feed. Stamp, stamp the icon to add or remove Amcrest logo from your live feed. Quick replay, tap the rewind clock icon to jump back in time from your live feed. Fisheye, tap the fisheye icon to de-warp the video live feed from fisheye device. Privacy mode, tap the mask icon to enable the privacy mode and hide the camera's lens for specific devices. Auto tracking mode, tap the human icon to enable the auto tracking mode and automatically tracking the human for specific devices. And the last step is to enjoy the Amcrest view. That's the end of the startup wizard. You can access the wizard at any time by going to the main menu slash help and then wizard as well. Press the OK button and here we are on the live feed. This is close to where I just now had my gimbal set up. There's my normal gimbal that I have my cellular device plugged in. I'm actually strapped to and it holds it sideways and keeps all the video stabilized for me. I just got done also going over a fantastic subscription service. It's called Scentbird. And I just now got that uh, video done not long ago as well. So I'll place that right there. Now we will do a little bit of the pan tilting and zooming right here. I'm gonna go ahead and swipe to the left and see if I can't get a good pan. There's my hand right there as I'm controlling it and what we're seeing on here that's very cool let's go ahead and pan down 
And then let's pan up a little bit as well. Wow, guys, that is amazing. It actually moves very smoothly and I like it a lot. I can't wait to test this product out even more. Check it out. The studio is a little dirty right now. Even the ceiling looks busted, but I am super excited to have gotten this product. Can't wait to put my SD card in there. I do have a 32 gigabyte uh, Samsung SD card. But now since we got the chance to check out the Amcrest, let's go ahead and go back to the normal view and I'll talk a little bit more with you guys. That about sums it up for the Amcrest 4 megapixel Wi-Fi pan and tilt indoor IP security camera. Let me know what you guys' thoughts are on this camera. If you have another Amcrest product or if you have any other comparable products that you think uh, I should also do a review on, leave a comment down in the comment section below. That would be greatly appreciated. I want to thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel for more great content. Hit that notification bell to stay up to date on our newest uploads. And as always, keep it real.